A strong wind, but just extremely cold. Temperatures low, doesn't take much wind to create that bad wind chill. Randy Factor Wednesday 3. It will be a nasty day to be working outside, much like this evening when you have to be out. Boy, you really got to bundle up and try and limit your time outside. Frostbite can occur as quickly as 30 minutes on exposed flesh. So wear your gloves, wear a hat. Super Doppler 7. It's quiet right now. No precipitation in local area. 4 a.m. to 10 a.m. is when the wind chill advisory is in effect in our area. That's where the temperatures will be lowest, but also a breeze will pick up from the southeast early in the morning. On Wednesday, skies currently clear, likely to stay that way through the night as we've got clear skies in South Dakota, Minnesota, Iowa, North Dakota, everywhere across the upper Midwest. Interestingly, going forward, there are some more snow chances. This is the North American mesoscale model, the NAM. Wednesday evening has half an inch to an inch and a half of snow near and north of the Omaha Metro and then brings in a bit more similar near and north of Omaha on Friday evening. This is the European computer model. There's the patch of snow on Wednesday evening. Here's the patch of snow for Friday evening. And then that's really it according to this computer model. But the American computer model, the GFS, it brings in the Wednesday evening snow, the Friday evening snow, but then also more snow Saturday. So all these things certainly bear watching. But that weekend snow different on this American GFS computer model and would bring us even colder weather to start the new year. Really cold tonight, coldest night so far this season and struggling to reach 10 in the afternoon as clouds move in. Three below right now. Winds are just seven miles an hour, but that creates a wind chill of about 15 below. Six and three below. The high and low today. Neither records, but extremely cold. Look at those highs in the single digits now. Most spots sub zero, save for the Millard Airport hanging on at three, heat island of the city. Look at this. Already double digits below zero, Norfolk and also Shenandoah. High pressure nearby, clear skies, light winds. By morning, already a southeast breeze, then clouds spread in. You can see a little light snow develop near and northeast of us. That's the Wednesday evening snow. And then Thursday, temperatures pushed into the 20s ahead of this front, but that brings down more cold air as we head toward Friday. Nine below zero, the low tonight, bitterly cold. Wind chill advisory in the morning, eight below for the temperature, but the wind chill 15 to 20 below, 10. That's it in the afternoon. It will stay around 10 all night tomorrow night, though, with the light snow chance. 24 on Thursday, then colder again with that northwest wind Friday. Light snow chance there, and then the question mark about Saturday. It looks like this is going to be the coldest New Year's Eve and New Year's Day in more than 20 years. You know.